Welcome back. I'm Lex Levy, and this is Ancient Odyssey. I explore the mysteries of ancient sites across the world. In today's episode, we travel to Wiltshire, England, for a private access adventure, investigating the second biggest Neolithic mound in Europe, Merlin's Mound. Next, we trek the spectacular ancient landscape of Wiltshire on the White Horse Trail to investigate an intriguing obelisk built over an ancient site atop of what appears to be a terraformed chalk mountain. Let's take a trip to Merlin's Mound in Wiltshire, England. And you can see, it absolutely dominates the center of the Marble College campus. Only students are allowed, unless you have private access permission, which we obtain, and we traverse this viral to the top. Alright everybody, we're in the Marlboro College campus. Right smack in the middle is Merlin's Mound. We've been given special permission access to climb to the top. Stained glass windows. I love it. There's so much ornate detail in the stone Yes. And all of the woodwork. Yeah, and, and this was built in days when they didn't have all the mechanical engineering, it was all done. And you think, they couldn't replicate that now. So the, the trade of masonry, yeah. stone fantastic. is fantastic, is a lost. Art. Yes. And there aren't people that are building like this today because we use metal and glass yeah, yeah. to build buildings. And it's a it's a fantastic ancient art, of course, coming from the building of the Egyptian pyramids, leading into structures like this where it's the same tradesmen and the same crafts group that was building all of these ancient structures. And it's it's beautiful. Predate silver. Yes, it's supposed to be older. Yes. yes. Yeah. Started possibly a thousand years before wow. and finished after. So they were still working on this during the again it's the construction of these ancient monuments across the planet is bewildering. And these were being built at the same time as their contemporary structures in the Egyptian pyramids. So around the same time period, 3500 BC, 2500 BC, they were building these mounds all across Europe. Oh, okay, so it's not yeah. just unique to the UK then? They're, they're, they're all across, yeah. Okay. 
Were they? Well, I mean, I don't know specifically where it, it obviously wasn't built to put a fort on, but the fort was put there at some point. Right, yeah. But I suppose a lot of others, they were just built as, were they burial mounds or burial chambers, some of them? Or? So it's, it's hard to say, like yeah. Silbury Hill. Because they've excavated that. Yep. And they, they didn't found find, that, they didn't right. find anything yeah, that's in right. Yeah. So some of them were certainly used as burial structures, but I think these may have had a different purpose. I mean, yeah. they're certainly ceremonial yeah. in sacred places in the landscape that was yeah. very significant to these ancient people. I think on some of them, they used to have funeral pyres on top. Sure, yeah. yeah. Again, it's why that guy decided to build a giant obelisk on the top of that mountain. I wonder what was up there originally that inspired him oh, to, the, oh, there. Yeah, to yeah, build yeah. that at yeah. Cheryl. Yeah, yeah. 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 Because it's a lot of effort to build that thing on the top of the mountain. <laughs> That's hollow as well. Oh yeah? That, yeah. that monument is hollow? Right. Yeah. Interesting. So they've recently um, cut all the trees back on here. I see that. storm or whatever was coming yeah, across yeah, the yeah, UK yeah. and of course you know we hit the ancient monument or we were out at Avebury just in the pouring rain for several hours um, but I wouldn't have it any other way <laughs> it's a nice it's a nice you, break you thought this is west. this is England <laughs> yeah yeah there you go I mean just don't worry just walk just walk around that barrier okay and it will spiral all the way up Thank you, Tony. And, and pop, back, pop back in when you're finished Absolutely. and I'll give you directions to the pub. Sounds good. Thank you so much. This you're is right. awesome. All right, no worries. All right, we're here on top of Merlin's Mound, located in the center of Marlborough College. We've just been given special permission access. Take a look around. given this print of the original depiction. We've seen three of five so far, and there's been an ancient site nearby every time. So follow me as we descend the spiral to the chapel.
And now, let's travel to the Cheer Hill Obelisk in Wiltshire, England. And you can see our journey as we hike up the Chalk Mountain on the White Horse Trail to the Stone Monument. Welcome back. This is day four of our expedition across ancient England, and we're going to make our way up to Cheer Hill Monument. at the Cheer Hill Monument and look there's a rainbow babe look behind you there's a rainbow oh that's beautiful <laughs> wow it's definitely the highest point in the vicinity.
and massive obelisk built on an ancient site by the founder of the Royal Society. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for more epic adventures from ancient Odyssey.